What's up, guys? So, um, the next scripture um, that we're gonna read this for this morning is um, Isaiah fifty-five seven. Isaiah fifty-five seven, and it says, "Let the sinful turn from his way, and the one who does." not know God turn from his thoughts let him turn to the Lord and he will have loving pity on him let him turn to our God for he will for sure forgive all all his sins Isaiah 55 7 I read it again let the sinful turn from his way and the one who does not know God turn from his thoughts let him turn to the Lord and he will get he will have lit, uh, loving pity on him let him turn to our God for he will for sure forgive all his sins and that was Isaiah 55 7 and and Isaiah 55 7 and um Definitely meditate on that and um uh let's uh just see how you can apply it to your life. Cause when we turn away from our sins and to come to God and that we turn away from our thoughts of what we from our old ways and we turn into and we turn to God. And we give our, our thoughts and all all these different things. The yeah. and he got us when we give give him a whole heart, and he will he will forgive us from our sins as we give him a chance in our life. And he loves you. I love you. God loves you. Peace. Talk to you later. What's up, guys? So, it's been a long day, um, but back at home, and um, I just wanted to come on here before um, I go to bed. Um, I was at uh, at work, had a great time at work, and um, I ate uh, some pizza. Ate some pizza and drunk some water. Uh, like I think it's like a splash. Uh, the water. Um, they got um berries in it. Like drunk uh, two of those. This is water right here. I really like it. This water right here. Yeah. Yeah, this water right here. I like it a lot. So. That's like my second bottle right now. But there ain't too much going on tonight. Just watching TV and um I'm just going to go to bed. Yeah, uh, just go from there. Cause this week has been really busy for me. I'm gonna be busy tomorrow and um Sunday. But let's get into the night scripture for tonight. Let's see. Let's get into it. Definitely meditate on the first one.
Let's see. Second Colossians thirty nine. Second Colossians thirty nine. And it says, For if you return to the Lord, your brothers and your sons will be shown pity by those who took who took them away. And will return to this land for the Lord your God is kind and loving. He will not turn his face away from you from you if you return to him. Second Colossians thirty nine. Let me read it one more time. <laughs> For if you return to the Lord, your brothers and your sons will be shown pity by those who took them away and will return to this land. For the Lord your God is kind and loving. He will not turn his face away from you if you return to him. Second Colossians thirty nine. Oh my I run drain. I don't know, some sometimes it's like with this I did with this uh macular macular degeneration. I run. It's like it's always this my my right eye, my eye run at times, like when I read and stuff. But that was called Second Colossians thirty nine. <sighs> um, that's my first time even reading that one. I ain't gonna lie to you. That's my first time even reading that one. It's like when you read the Bible. It's like always something new that you're reading. Like you end up reading. It's always something new. And that's really my first time ever seeing that one. That scripture. And this is up on the, um, the subject of guilt. But I hope this encourages you. Um, and stuff. That when we turn away from our old ways. And turn to God. And. He will help us. On our path and our thoughts. Giving us new creative. New creativity and. Things to. Be. Productive. In this. In this world. Because. These days of times, we can get distracted very easily, and we're too amazing. We're too amazing to allow crazy things to distract us and take our energy when we can put that energy in something positive. And that goes for me and goes for anybody else. That we stop allowing things to drain our positive energy. Because what happens? We end up becoming bitter, angry, and not want to be around people. Because our positive energy then went down so low. I don't know who's that for, but it just came, came to me that we stop allowing that uh, stop allowing things to drain our positive energy. Because we're too amazing. We're too amazing. And the main thing is that we, we thank God that we have a family and 
Thank God we have our friends and we start thinking about the good things that we have to build our positive energy back. And we told we we are amazing. But I'm definitely going to holler y'all on the next video. I know this video is short because I've been um, at work mostly all day. And um, that should be why the video is going to be short today because I'm tired. And plus, I, I love my job. I, I like my job a lot. And talking to the customer, great customers. And, but I'm definitely going to holler to later because I'm tired. And I love you. God loves you. Peace. God bless.